We're thrilled to announce our Hydrology and Hydraulics Essentials training series, which comprises eight live interactive online courses that you can see here. So we've got four courses in May covering surface water hydrology, so quantifying the flow, and four more courses in June covering surface water hydraulics, so characterizing that flow. We'll follow up later in the year with groundwater and water quality, but to give you a preview of the contents of these courses, we're going to plan on kicking it off with a free webinar in March, which will give you a feel for the approach that we'll be taking, and that is to take the most essential elements of the underlying principles focusing on those things that are most crucial and really trying to make it as useful as possible to you for your work. We'll try to make it as uh, as practical and concise as we can and in that regard we've gone and scoured the globe for the most engaging presenters we can find, instructors from across uh, industry and academics. We've assembled a master class for you using experts from Europe, Africa, Asia, North and South America and what we what we find is one of the challenges in teaching water modeling courses that we offer is that we'll get a really wide range of backgrounds in terms of the principles of hydrology and hydraulics. So whether you're interested in getting just a refresher or maybe filling in some gaps in the background principles that are needed, uh, this course series is geared toward professionals and practitioners in the water space. You will receive continuing education credits for your attendance, but we really think it will benefit any career in the water sector. So just highlight a couple of the things that we'll be covering. Course one, meteorology and precipitation what's coming out of the sky, dropping onto the ground, taking precipitation data, gauge data, and finding out what you need to do to that to plug it into your rainfall runoff model. We will cover a full course on infiltration and losses. What happens to that water once it hits the ground? Where is it held up? Where can it get stored? Is it going to be stored in the soil or seeping through the ground? We'll cover flow routing in course number three. And that's going to involve a discussion about rainfall runoff models uh, in a routing model versus a rain on grid model, which is becoming more and more common these days. We'll talk about the probable maximum flood, probable maximum precipitation, and selecting a model and calibrating the peak flow rates. These all involve hands-on practical applications with workshop exercises where you can try out the principles that we explain. Our fourth course is on stochastics and turning things into frequency analyses and what do we mean by annual exceedance probability or uh, average recurrence intervals and things like that. Taking regression equations and plugging those in with our flood frequency analysis and developing histograms. So that rounds out our surface water hydrology courses. We'll then move into surface water hydraulics, starting with hydrostatics, just standing water. What, what do the pressures look like? Then we start moving that standing water and converting the potential energy into kinetic energy. We'll explain the Froude number and key concepts involved in open channel flow. We'll then get into 1D, 2D, and 3D flow. Some of these terms that get bounced around that sometimes are hidden in the black box of the program, we really want to make these accessible to you. And we'll cover some of the key equations, the Manning's equations, Navier-Stokes, St. Benat. We'll address the Courant number and other really important concepts to grasp in selecting whether you want to do a 1D, a 2D, or a 3D approach. We will also cover pipe flow that will include developing energy gradients and hydraulic gradients for pipes. And finally, our last course of the series will cover the flood hazard, scour, and sedimentation. Get into riprap sizing and some of the scour. And we have in a lot of these more detailed courses that are available, but this really is intended to get you just the details that are needed to get you going. So we're excited again to be offering this and that registration link, as I said, is live now. We'd love to see you online.